Hi, I'm Steve Wilde and it's a beautiful early August evening and tonight, now the thunderstorms have abated, we're going to try and get a couple of cool fallow books on the floor. The fallow books, really, they're in big bachelor groups here and they have been making a bit of a mess in the barley, treading it down, lying down in it. It's as much to do the farmer a bit of a favour as to fill the call sheet as we go on. I'm using my Blaza R8 Professional Success in 308. I'm using Hornady SSTs um, in 150 grain. I've got my Frontier 30, five to 30 times 50 scope on top. It's the same scope as I use all the time really, it's what I took to Alaska with me. This is basically my normal stalking package, it's what I go out with all the time and um, I'm really really familiar with it, love it to bits, so no more ado, let's um, crack on and see if we can find ourselves a fallow book. So we've just come through the wood out of one cornfield, cut across the wood, and we've just got into three books there. They were a little bit too good for what we're after tonight. We're after either a young one or an older book, but they looked like three nice books in the prime. Didn't, couldn't really see if they got any nasty fishtails or anything in their antlers, so we've let them mosey on. I'm going to come out of the wood now, and then we're going to stalk down the side of this field. If we don't get anything down the side of this field, I've got a high seat in an oak tree down there on the point of the wood and we'll sit in there for about half an hour and just see what comes. So there we go, absolutely perfect result. 
exactly what I was after. Young Prickett in front, Young Sorrel at the back. The reason I took this guy out, he was stood with, I think, three other quite a lot bigger books. One of them I think will make a really nice book when he comes into hard antler. He seemed to be throwing his head about a lot on his back. I studied him for quite a while. I couldn't see anything wrong with his antlers, but made the decision, took him out. And then as we were coming to retrieve him, we come over the brow of the hill and there was two more prickets stood in the bottom. So I took my chance, next shot the other pricket. Exactly what we were after, perfect evening. So one thing, time is of the essence now. We've got to get the grolic done as quickly as we can, get these guys back, get them skinned out and get them in the chiller as soon as we can. Perfect.